This is how you walk, by the way. My son's got it now. With your legs, I say, yeah, baby. It's just the arms get involved, isn't that odd? Your arms do this. Your legs are doing most of the work, but your arms think, I'm going to do something. I don't want to just sit here. Because <laughs> it looks odd if you don't use This is odd, isn't it? This is odd. <laughs> Although this is quite good and you're saving energy in your arms, just a little bit. But it just hasn't caught on. I mean, wh why do we just conform to one way of walking? Well, I've realised if you use the same amount of energy with the natural arm swing, but go together, <laughs> you actually propel yourself. <laughs> I'm moving twice as fast as the average walker. I'm doing this now. People are walking normally, I go flying past. <laughs> They're like, what are you doing? I'm winning, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> And I'm also, I've also felt, as I'm sure everyone in this room has as well, that skipping, although socially unacceptable <laughs> for anyone above the age of six, is actually a remarkably easy way of moving. <laughs> We've all thought this. You put hardly any effort at all, then you just start moving around very easily. Because running is difficult, it's very heavy, but skipping is magnificent! <laughs> so what I'm doing now, by combining the two, 